I'm Debbie from the home of interiors.co.uk and this video is going to talk you through the new um, curtain pole solution from Rolls Neo for L-shaped windows suitable for eyelet curtains and heavyweight eyelet curtains. Um, the new bay pole has been designed specifically for eyelet curtains, however you can use the system with curtain headings that take the curtain rings as well. And this is a great solution for L-shaped windows um, and it can take bends up to 90 degrees um, so it really offers the full solution um, if you've got a window requirement that needs the, the two sides with a, with a corner piece. And the poles are available in a 28mm or a 35mm um, and we've set the poles up on our website to be suitable for L-shaped windows of 360 centimetres long. So you will get a single piece pole at 240 centimetres and one at 120 centimetres to give you the, the total length of 360. However, the Neo poles are available in 120 centimetre, 150, 180, a 240 and a 3 metre as a single piece. So if your L-shaped window has a different pole requirement, please get in touch and we can pull together a bespoke quotation to suit your window requirements. The brackets enable the curtain poles to take the heavyweight curtains. They are solid die cast. On the L-shaped windows, you will receive one end bracket for the end of the shortest pole, and then you will receive two brackets for the end of the longest length pole to give it the um, support it needs on that longer length. The grub screws um, come in the fixing pack um, and just need to be positioned on the brackets before you start installing um, the brackets onto the wall. And the best piece of advice is just to um, position the, um, the grub screw, tighten it up, put your finger inside and as soon as you feel the, the grub screw coming through the other side, just stop. Um, that will prevent um, the, the, the screw from scratching the pole. So just make sure that you don't push the grub screw too far through um, as, it may, may, as I say, it may just scratch that pole. With regards to the corner piece, this piece comes as a 26 cm straight piece of pole that I've pre-bent to the 90 degrees to show you. Um, with regards to the bend, the cut section of pole needs to face inwards into the bay um, and needs to face to towards you when you're bending it. It's recommended that you bend it over your knee, but as the pole has been cut, please just place, place a tea towel or a piece of fabric over your knee to stop the, the, the cuts just pinching your skin and then it just simply bends into place. With regards to the bending, it's recommended if you can bend it roughly to the right angle um, and then just position it on the floor or on a windowsill um, or actually at the, in the corner of the bay just to see whether you know, you've got the angle right. Don't worry if it isn't spot on. Um, as you fix it to the straight poles, there is give in the corner piece so it will just adjust um, just to, to fit those poles and then just to give you that, that beautiful curve around your, your bend. Please note that the corner piece hasn't been designed to be bent and straightened and bent and straightened and if you bend it the wrong way um, you will damage the corner piece as well so just make sure that you are bending it the right way before you start. Um, once it's bent then don't re-straighten it, if it isn't quite right as I say as you fix it to the straight poles there is just there is give in it, it is flexible and it will just um, flex slightly to, to fit the poles and then give you that lovely curve. With regards to the um, the corner pieces, you get two connecting pieces um, that just twist into the, the corner piece. Please don't push them in because these little um, rubber rings may just come, come out of the, of the grooves if you push it. So it is a twist fit and you simply twist the connecting pieces into the corner piece. The pole just twists onto the, um, onto the connecting piece. The poles are available in all of the Neo finishes, so in a stainless steel, a chrome, a spun brass and a black nickel finish, and with all of the finials in the Neo range, so the original finials, then we have the Neo Style, the Neo Oak and the Neo Premium. So any of these finials are available on the L-shaped L um, curtain poles. The pole on the website can be ordered with or without rings, so if you've got eyelet curtains, obviously order it without the rings. We recommend a 40mm eyelet is used on a 28mm pole and a 50mm eyelet on a 35mm pole. With regards to where to position the rings or the eyelets, if you are using the pole with the one end bracket for lightweight curtains, 
Simply a curtain ring is positioned next to the finial on the other side of the bracket and that's the same for the eyelet. So one eyelet near the finial and all the rest to follow on the, uh, on the rest of the pole. If you're using the pole for all curtain weights with the recommended two end brackets, um, for curtain rings you position a curtain ring next to the finial, one in the middle of the two brackets with the rest to follow on the rest of the pole. Um, eyelet, there's two options. Um, and it really depends on the fullness of your curtain. So if you've got really thick, full curtains, you could position one eyelet next to the finial, two eyelets in the middle, with the rest to follow on the pole. However, if your fabric is a little bit more restricted and you haven't quite got the, the fullness in the curtains, you can put one eyelet at the, um, next to the finial and then the other eyelets all to follow this side of the bracket. And we've just got a couple of photos now to show you the two options. So the first photograph shows the option um, with full curtains, with an eyelet next to the finial, two in the middle, and the rest to follow on the, the pole. And the second photo shows less full curtains, with an eyelet next to the finial, and then the other side of the two brackets, with the, with the rest of the eyelets to follow. Just to show you what the, um, the pole looks like with the eyelet curtains on it, and just how nicely they glide round the 90 degree bend. As you'll see, just a very, very nice, no brackets to interfere, um, and just gives a really, really nice, smooth um, draw around those bends. So, as previously mentioned, the brochure is on the website and that has all the information and all the different options um, for you to have a read through. Um, there's also full fitting instructions that are downloadable on the website as well. Um, but if you have any questions, need any advice, please contact us on 01590 615 or email sales at thehomeofinteriors.co.uk. And likewise, if you've got an L-shaped window that needs longer poles or shorter poles than what we've got on the website, please get in touch and we can give you a bespoke quotation. We hope you found this video informative and useful. If you have, please do give us a thumbs up and pop any comments um, in the box below. Please subscribe to our channel over here and our full playlist is over here if there's any other videos that you'd like to see. Thank you for watching.